Hey everyone, welcome to uh, Ranking Pokemon Star Types with uh, Claire and Josh. I'm Claire. I'm Josh. <laughs> uh, so, I came up with this the other night. I was just sitting there thinking, you know, the uh, fire type starters are definitely like, you know, my because I was doing like Platinum Nuzlocke, and I was like, you know, the fire type starters are definitely my favorite ones. But I'm like, I think I like the grass ones next, but I wasn't entirely sure. Um, and so I decided to do this weird kind of ranking system. Um, and I was like, you know what, let's see what, what Claire's are too. Uh, so, we're gonna, uh, we're gonna go through each generation. Um, each starter evolutionary line is gonna get a number between, uh, that's gonna get like a 3, 2, or 1. Or we're gonna total them up at the end and see which one of the types is our favorite. I already kinda did mine, um, but Claire's gonna go through hers. Uh, we're gonna kinda discuss them as we go through them. In real time. In, yeah, some real time. <laughs> um... But yeah, uh, I, I think the reason I thought of it too is because like since I was playing Platinum and almost I was always surprised that like I liked Empoleon because it's a steel penguin. And I'm like that's mm. really cool. I'm like I don't normally like water type stutters, but this one's pretty cool. And cute. He's on. He's he's strong. <laughs> and cute. That's gonna be her uh, criteria. Um, but for so Claire's played a ton of the gens, but so I'm gonna have to give her like a little preamble for some of them, but. We're just going to go ahead and get started here, and so, let's see. Gen 1, um, pretty, pretty standard. We all know our favorites here. It's still hard for me to choose, though. Yeah. Every time I play. I mean, I, I'll bounce back and forth between Charmander and Squirtle. Um, I I'll... actually bounce back and forth between Squirtle. Wordle and Bulbasaur. Uh, Bulbasaur is cute, but he just gets, like, uglier over time, is I the guess, problem. but who doesn't like Venusaur? I don't. Well, that's rude. <laughs> look, look, he's got, like, all these bumps on him and stuff. I mean, granted, Blast, it's hard to be Blastoise, Blastoises. Well, I was gonna say, the thing is, too, so, like, with all the Gen 1 pandering that the Pokemon Company likes to do, and let's, let's, I'm a Gen 1 person, too, so I have some appreciation for it. Like, they've given them all these extra versions, so, mm -hmm. like, I will say, the one thing, I, okay, like, I don't like... Venusaur's Mega Evolution, but I like its uh, Gigantamax form. I think this looks cool. Yeah. Um, well, I like I like most Gigantamax forms. Yeah, a lot of them are. They're really cool. interesting. Yeah. Uh, I don't like Blastoise's Mega Evolution, but I also I I love his Gigantamax form too. Like he's a freaking he's like a, he's just a tank. He's like he's like a battleship or something. <laughs> um, and then out of like Charizard's three extra ones. Yeah. I only like the. X form figures, the, and that's the one that's like part dragon too. So that one's like bad badass. But like, I don't know. So like, do you want to do them out loud, or do you want to just keep it all secret, or do you want to? Cause like, it's up to you. I mean, I guess I can say mine out loud. Yeah, let's, let's do them out loud. So you go first. Um, I'm choosing Squirtle first, then Bulbasaur, then Charmander. Okay, so Water three, yeah. Grass two, Fire one. Yep. For me, it was uh, Fire three, Water two. Uh, grass one, because okay. I'm just really, really not feeling <laughs> that. As, Apparently. I, I, I like Ivysaur, though. Um, let's see, Gen 2. So, Gen 2, as time has gone on, by the way, like, I like the Gen 2 starters a lot less. I used to think they really? were pretty cool, but, like, I don't know, They're to me, they're pretty plain, and, like, they've done so much more interesting things with the starters as it's gone on, like, gone on, giving them, like, extra types and stuff. Um... But I don't know. So, did you play any of these Gen 2 games? I can't remember. No. Um, okay, so we've got Chikorita, Bayleaf, Meganium, mm -hmm. Cyndaquil, Koala, Typhlosion, Totodile, Croconaw, and Feraligatr. Yeah. Uh, same, this is like my, like, atyp like, the, not atypical, uh, my, like, prototypical, like, one of, like, Fire still is number one for me here. This is my atypical one because Fire is also my number oh, one Oh, yeah? Here. You think it's cute? Yeah. I loved Cyndaquil as a kid. I thought it was so cool. But he it's like the the line kind of in terms of fire starters, he's gone down on the list for me because he's kinda of just plain. Yeah. Although I still like his design. Um so here, do you wanna do yours? Yeah, so this one I'm doing fire as my first pick, then grass, and then water, which is very Weird. strange for me, I know. Do but I don't know, I'm just not a big fan of uh Totodile. Really? I yeah. always thought it was cool. You know, are you just not like a fan of Gators or? No, I like Gators. Uh, I just I don't know. He's kind of annoying to me. Oh, I thought it was cute. So I went. Mine's like Fire Three, Water Two, Grass One for this. Yeah. So the, like I said, exact same as my Gen One one. 
So you did play Gen 3, because you said you played Emerald, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. I mean... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, do, you, do you have a favorite out of these ones? I mean, yeah, Mudkip all the way. Really? Yeah. Oh, hard Mudkip. Oh, okay. Well, we're going to have to have a discussion later about your choices in life. <laughs> Love yeah. You. Yeah, I love you. Um, yeah, Mike is my least favorite out of there. Really? Yeah. He's alright. I do like Mega Swampert, though. Like, he looks so badass. Like, look at him. <laughs> that, that boy goes to the gym every day. I mean, I like Mudkip. <laughs> I don't know. Well, I just like... I, I think part of it, too, is that I like the other one just so much more. So this was the first time that they gave the fire type... Like, people make fun of it now for giving the fire type the fighting as, like, the secondary type so it could fight, like, rock Pokemon and stuff like that. But this was, like, the first time they did it. And so, like, I have a real soft spot in my heart for, like, Blaze again. But honestly, like, I like the Sceptile line, like, the I the figured best. you would. It's, and here's, there's a weird reason for it. Why? It's because, like, if you look back at the other ones, with maybe the exception of Kind of Bayleaf, um, and, like, other grass Pokemon in general, uh, they always kind of have the sort of, like, status, or, like, I, I'd call it, like, the mage role. They always use, like, you know... Uh, poison powder and stun spore and they're all about like doing these like setups and using mega drain but like the reason I liked like Trico and stuff like that was because he wasn't he was like more like a physical attacker although I think his actual stats lay out that special attacks are but like I looked at him more like you know not like mage type but like warrior type like he has like mm-hmm. leaf blade is his special move like his, his like signature move yeah was... I mean I get that feel from like a lot of the grass types yeah yeah. You th- like, uh, that they're, like, all, like... That they're more, like, magey than, yeah. like, fighter-esque, yeah. yeah. And he, like, he's got, like, And he's he kind of like, defies that, yeah. Well, he's got, like, freaking blades on his arms. Mm-hmm. Cool. I was, like, I was, like, 14 when this game came out, so, you know, I was, like, real edgy about it. <laughs> he's actually my least favorite for this gen. What? Yeah. Okay, you know, that's fair, because Blaziken does exist, and Blaziken's pretty mm-hmm. cool. Also, Torchic's pretty cute. Yeah. I even like Combuskin. Like, it's it's kind of goofy, but I still kind of like it. Oh, really? Yeah. Like, yeah, no, for this one, it's water first, then fire, then... What do you think of the Mega, mega Evolution, by the way? Um, actually, Torchix is my least favorite. <gasps> mega Blaziken looks so dope, I don't, I, I don't... I can't support any Pokemon that looks vaguely like a human. I just can't do it. It's just too weird for me. I don't want to tell Especially you. considering that he comes from something that looks like a little chick. Yeah. Like a baby chick. I've got bad Not about news. it. I got bad news for you about, like, Gardevoir, though, on the internet. <laughs> I know about Gardevoir on the internet. <laughs> um, no, I was to say... Oh, yeah, so your rankings? I already said. Oh, sorry. Water first, fire, then grass. Yeah, for me, it's uh, grass first, fire, then water. Do, do, do. All right, Gen Four. What do you think? This is like what kind of sparked this. Um, so typing wise, you know, uh, Turtwig here eventually becomes uh, Grass Ground. Mm-hmm. Um, they went again with the firefighting thing, and then in a weird move, they made Empoleon Steel Water, yeah. which was really yeah. cool. I'm like a Steel I know. Water Penguin. I like Steel Water combo. Like, I mean, sure, you all of a sudden have, like, a, like don't have as big a resistance to fire. Like, a, like it becomes a neutral instead of just being resistant. But, I, I don't know. I still think it's, like, pretty badass. Um, this one's real easy for me. Yeah, go for it. Water, grass, fire. Uh, oh, my God. I think it's our first one the same. Nope. Water, fire, grass. I'd I, say, I, I'm I, I sure like. you're, you're choosing a fire fighting type. He's over I mean, grass. I mean, he looks so. Infernape's cool, all right? Okay. Sure. All right. Gen 5. Um, this one's a weird one for me because, like, I do like the Tepig line, but uh, I don't know. I'm not. A, I've always liked the more, like, quick characters in terms of, like, design and mm-hmm. stuff, you know, like that. So, like, he's, like, kind of a tanky guy. I was going to say, I like the tanky, though. All right. Actually, in this one, I really don't like. um... The grass. Yeah. I really, I, I hated uh, the Snivy line. Yeah, I just, yeah, yeah. Uh, he just looks real smug. 
Well, he just like I don't know his design. Like it's just like too much. Like he, like loses limbs over time. And also <laughs> oh, yeah. like I hate snakes. I'm sorry, but like it just I know you it, know. as like I'm like ugh no. Like have a snake starter? No, thank you. Um, Water, fire, grass. Same. Yeah. Really? Yeah, okay. Yeah, it's exactly the same. Water, fire, grass. Because here's the thing. Like samurai. Like he's a freaking samurai. He's yeah. a samurai. And then like what? Like and he busts out. Especially like, even like Duo out here who busts out like Ooh. dual like water shell sword things. He's pretty cool. I, I can't get past that. <laughs> All right. Okay, so this was weird. This was a gen that introduced Mega Evolutions, but they didn't give the starters Mega Evolutions. Instead, they gave Mega Evolutions to... I gotta say, this is the gen I'm least familiar with, because uh, they don't even look that familiar to me. Um, that's what it is. I forgot I used this picture from the uh, chest button line. Um, they went, like, with an interesting, like, ninja, mage, uh, like, tank thing here. Yeah, was, I was gonna uh, say... This is very much defying my my normal picks. This one's tough for me because I actually this like a lot of the I like a lot of the middle ones for this, but that, so it's hard to like. I like um, Fennekin and like uh, what's his name? Uh, I just had it in my head. Oh my god! I don't know. Delphox is that evolution, but um. Just from a like a visual standpoint, I like these all equally. Oh really? <laughs> and it's very hard to choose. <laughs> Man. I like the ninja aspect of Greninja, but I don't really like the tongue scarf thing. It kind of freaks me out a little bit. I kind of like that. Oh, really? Because I was leaning towards them being last, and then I saw the tongue scarf, and I was like, that's kind of cool. And then, like, I like I like Braxton, Braxton I think, uh, but I don't really like Delph. I understand, like, what they're going for, but I, it it's design-wise, it becomes too flowy for me, and I liked it more, like, agile looking here. Uh, I don't know. What did I go with for mine on this? Oh. Oh, okay. Wait, no. Hang on. That's not right. Oh, yeah. That's it. All right, I think right. I have mine. You go first. All right, grass, then fire, then water. I think I did. Oh wow, I did uh, water, grass, fire. Man, I have a fire last night. Jesus. Wow. Yeah, I guess Crazy. so. Crazy. I, I think... even put it second. Man, that's weird. Okay, I guess uh, you know what it was. I think something about I liked his like real tanky like uh, like knight design here because he's what they called chestnut. Yeah. Um. Let's see. Going on to sun and moon. So, okay, Sun and Moon for me is, like, one of the, like, yeah. weakest, like, starter lineups. I, like, okay, here, here's my gripes with them, is that they all get more disappointing as they go on, with the exception of, like, um, oh my god, I can't think of what remember saying. I know it's, like, Primarina is what it ends up as, but, uh, cause, like, okay, like, Rowlet here? Rowlet's cute. And then it just kind of gets worse, like, uh, Decidueye's cool in concept, but I don't like its actual design. Um... And then, um, uh, let's see, I know that's Torcat, and then Incineroar, I can't remember what the thing's name, oh, Witten. I like, yeah, Litten. I, I think Witten itself is cute, I don't like this middle Litten's design, cute. and I just did not like Incineroar, but I'm like, I'm like Litten's cute, so. Rowlet, then Litten, and then the stupid fucking seals, I do not like <laughs> I don't the like water the, yeah, types I for this round. I did not like them. Uh, you go for, so as you said, three... Uh, three for grass. Yeah. Two for fire, water, or one. Yeah, yeah. So that's grass right. is fave, then fire, then water. I'm just saying you're. That's okay. You got you got a couple of little water scores. Oh, I know. Uh, yeah. For me, yeah. No, wait. That's. Oh yeah. Okay. Three, three for grass. I still like Rowlet's line because especially because it comes like ghost and it's like an archer and stuff like that. Um, <laughs> living that ranger life, you know. Yeah. Uh. Then I, th I think I did, let's see, yeah, three for grass, two for fire, one for water. Yep. I think between this we had and- the same. This and, like, Gen 3 are why I was thinking, I'm like, I think I like grass. Grass is my second favorite type, and then <laughs> I realized I was wrong. So, here we are, oh, Gen Oh, you know what I'm going with. Uh, so when you played, you started with Sabo, and I started with Scorpion, yeah. right? Yeah. Um, what do you think of their Gigantamax forms, by the way? Um, I really like mine, Inteleons. That's the only thing I like about yours. <laughs> yeah, he's a freaking dope sniper. I like the sniping aspect. I don't like his regular. Um, I also like though. the drums too. What? I actually um, what's what's the fire score bunny? Score bunny, yeah. yeah. And then it becomes uh, it's then Raboot and then um, Cinderace. Okay, yeah, Cinderace is my least favorite of the Mega Evolutions. He was just It's just a giant flame ball. 
I you know? Oh, well, it's I mean... It's not as fun. Yeah, I... I don't know, I like it better than the drums. Well, I don't know, I just feel like... No, I feel like the drums and the sniper are way more thought out. I guess, but he's like a soccer player. Like, Cinderace is like also one of the lower ones, like, fires... I wanted his design to be so much cooler. When I when I, like when I saw yeah. Score Bunny, I'm like, Score Bunny looks cool. I really hope they do something interesting with him. And then I'm like, Rabbit's all right. And then I saw like Cinderace. I'm like, eh. I was hoping for something a little more. Like I think like a lot of people were expecting something like the Summer Wars like yeah. thing. And I was like, that'd be cool. But we're going water, then grass, then fire for this round. Uh, I think I went I, the Grookey line. I actually kind of do like it's it's yeah. it's grown on me. Um, I went fire, grass, water. Wow, even though you saw how badass I don't the boy was. Like, it's so weird. I don't like how it shoots out of, like, its finger. It freaks me out. Um, but you like anime and everything in anime shoots That's out of different. I don't like it, like, when it's, like, a biological thing. I like, like... Okay. It it's a different thing. Well, I'm tallying mine up. All right. Uh... So, like, I did mine ahead of time, so I got 18 for fire, which was expected as being the highest... Uh, 16 for water, and 14 for grass, which was kind of surprising, because I thought grass was going to be a little higher. I thought I definitely liked grass a lot more. All right, I'm almost done. Okay, so yeah, that makes yeah, sense. Yeah. Mine was, I had 18 total points for water, 16 total points for grass, and 14 total points for fire. So, so that makes sense. That seems about right to I you. usually choose water, then grass, then fire. But okay. it was a, cl a lot closer than I thought okay. it was going to be. I yeah. mean, there, every single one was only off by two points. Yeah, that, that's the thing. Like, same here. I, yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm sure well, that's how it should be. It's, cause, I mean, you know, unless you really, like, didn't like fire a lot and really didn't like... I guess. Yeah. Um, I was going to say, though... Because technically, you could have eight points for something if you really didn't like Yeah. Them. I uh, I was surprised, because, like, I don't really... Like, I think we have, the, like, everyone who's seen Last Airbender has that conversation. It's like, oh, what kind of bender are you? And water's usually at the bottom of my list. Oh, water's always at the top of my list. Yeah, and so, like, I was like, I'm like, I didn't think I'd like that many water starters, but apparently I was wrong. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, but yeah, if you like this video, uh, like and subscribe for more, and... What are what are your yeah. favorite starters? Yeah, you Put do, them down below. Give us your scores, too. Let us know. See, uh, Mine are purely based off of how cute they are, so... <laughs> yeah, no no battle statistics here. Um, <laughs> although, you know, there, there is in mine for, for a couple of mine. Like, that's also why I like, like Empoleon, for instance. Like, yeah, mentioned. yeah. Or, um... I mean, I obviously am, like, attached to some of mine that I yeah. do play as, but, like... I, I forgot to mention this back when we looked at, like, Sceptile, but, like, Sceptile becomes, um, when he gets uses Mega Witch, he becomes part dragon. And I think that's dope. Yeah, you're into dragons. I am. Well, it's a good type. <laughs> Before they introduced fairy. I mean, yeah. that was actually the same generation they introduced fairy when they gave him Megas. Uh, but yeah, let us know what yours are. Uh, you can do the same ranking as we did, and well, I give us a reason, too. Uh, but, catch you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye!